What's going on? This is Julian with Game Fanatics, and today we're back with another gaming hardware video. And we'll be talking about this small keyboard here, the Whirlwind FX Atom Mechanical Keyboard. Um, so if you do remember, last year uh, we made a little video about this. It's, uh, I guess you can call it, it's Big Brother. Uh, the world the whirlwind effects element keyboard um, So let's put these right next to each other. So these smaller keyboards Have really been but been becoming popular um, in many people's setup so First I'll, I'll go with this one. So if we if you remember we talked about this very high uh, build quality we have some almost like brushed aluminum then we have a carbon fiber back, of course, mechanical keyboard, I believe. Yes, we have the red switches on here. Um, and it's the same on the Atom keyboard, which is kind of that middle ground, not too clicky, not too soft button. But along with shrinking this down to be so small, um, there are a few other improvements that, that I really like. Um, so it did change to be a plastic body um, and again we do have the cherry red switches let me see yeah if you can see that uh, i'll add some additional b-roll in of those and you can pick between I, I believe the the cherry red the brown and the blue if i'm not mistaken um one cool thing that I really like, if you, you'll see here, um, there is a now a USB-C port instead of a connected braided cable. The cable is still braided, so I, I'm, I really enjoy that. Now, if you are going to switch to uh, a keyboard of this size, there are a few compromises that you will have to make. Um, but in many cases, um, People don't really miss these buttons too much. So of course you do not have a number pad. Um, and many of the buttons are now changed to function keys. And I'll show you um, some B-roll of that. But along the front face of the buttons are now where those um, logos and, and labels are, are housed. But I didn't really know if I would like a keyboard this small or not but there are some great use cases if you're traveling around you don't really like using the keyboard on your um, on your laptop or if you have some type of tablet that allows you to, to plug in a USB keyboard uh, this just pops right in your bag really really like I said a solid build and then it has those that same integration with the whirlwind effects desktop app that um, allows you to customize how the lights display with the game. It could, it could correspond to what you have on your computer screen. It can correspond to um, a multitude of games that that are constant, that list is constantly growing. Um, I'll put the price of this keyboard on the screen. But like I said, it's really cool. If, if you're a minimalist or you have one of those minimal setups, um, this is very, this has been very popular. Um, when it comes to the those, those type of setup scenarios so um i mean i'm sure I don't, i'm not going to say drop it but i'm sure you can drop this you won't have it could take some some dings and some hits but really really nice product the whirlwind effects atom um we'll probably have a few more details if you go over to the gamefanatics.com and, and check out the article that this video is linked to and yeah Again, World Effect, Whirlwind Effects has a lot of things that you can add to your PC setup. They have light strips, they have a, um, a set of speakers that actually uh, corresponds to other video games and blows different temperatures of air into your face. Uh, just kind of up that immersion factor. Uh, and, I, and I have to thank them for sending this uh, review unit over. Um, ever since I met them, they've been really, really good um to work with and yeah i mean they provide great products so again this has been julian checking out the whirlwind 
effects atom keyboard definitely definitely check it out if you're in the market and uh we'll see you next time